So please kindly tell us about yourself. My name is Mrs. Gloria Lamte. I worked in the bank for nearly 27 years and I retired in August 2004. Um, in the bank I rose to become the head of department so uh, you can imagine that uh, a lot of my work involved sitting down for very, very long hours. Sometimes you can have a meeting from say 9.30 to about 4.30. Um, I used to do a lot of stretching by getting up to go and see people instead of asking my secretary to do things. I will walk up to her so that she, uh, I feel a little more relieved. And sometimes I'll climb stairs and go down just to stretch, but mainly it was a, there was too much sitting. Wow, wow. So, Auntie Gloria, how did you hear about the Chiropractic and Wellness Centre? There is a lady friend of mine I go to church with, and I knew she had had a lot of problems in her posture, in her working, in her walking. So, I one day asked her how things were with her, and she said, Oh, thanks to Chiropractic. I am feeling much better, so I said, would you mind taking me there? And she did, and that's how I came to the Chiropractic and Wellness Center. So, Auntie Gloria, how long have you been in, at the Chiropractic and Wellness Center? I started this year in January, that is 2009 January. So why, why did you come to the Chiropractic and Wellness Center? I came to the Chiropractic Center because I was in a lot of pain. There was a lot of pain first in my arms and then my neck, then my back, then my lower back. I had no idea that the pains I was feeling in my arms had something to do with my spine. So when the pains got unbearable, I saw a doctor who diagnosed that I had spondylosis. So I started by wearing the collar and I found wearing the collar extremely uncomfortable. So I dropped it completely and just wore the ones for the evening. It's supposed to be softer but I found it also very uncomfortable. So I was happy when my friend introduced me to chiropractic. So did, did, did the pain somehow restrict your, your efficiency at work? Uh, well, when I was working, I didn't have the problems. What well, all I had was the pain in my arms, and from the time I retired, the pains got worse and worse. And there were times that I even had to shed tears because the pains were very, very excruciating. Wow! 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 So, has chiropractic improve your health? A great deal. The pains in the arms have stopped. And as I said, I have had those pains in my arms for <clears throat> around five years. Wow. So um, I know the difference now that the pains are no more there. Wow, 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 wow. So what will you say about chiropractic in general? I think it's a good way of treatment because it gets to a point when one takes too many drugs and we all know that almost all the drugs we take have side effects. So for me personally, the great thing about chiropractic is the fact that you don't take any drugs. And then the tip they give us like the fact that the body heals itself and the chiropractic people are just like assistants. I have seen that a lot. Wow, wow, wow. That's, that's great. So what do you think about our, our urge to educate the practice members through our workshops, our Jenny to Warner's booklets? What do you think about that? I think it is something that you should do even more because frankly I hadn't heard about the chiropractic for a long time. I, I first heard about it about two years ago before I came here. And I believe most people haven't heard about chiropractic at all. So I believe that the center should go all out through the various media, print, electronic, and so on, and let people know about it. Because some people have been going to hospital 
for very long time. They are taking drugs which make no difference whatsoever. And since I have the experience of getting better in chiropractic, I think it would be very good for other people to learn and also come here for their treatment. The treatment. And Gloria, what do you think about the staff of the chiropractic awareness center? I, the first thing I noticed about the staff is that they are very enthusiastic. They are very friendly. They seem to know the names of almost everybody who comes here and that makes you feel special. I mean, if you entered and somebody goes, hello Auntie Gloria, how are you? It makes you feel a sense of belonging. And for me, it's almost like part of the treatment. Wow. And what do you think are the opinions of other practice members towards car the chiropractic and wellness centers. Do you think they are also enjoying their care? Oh, I have met uh, several people here that I talk to and they even encourage me more because some of them also told me about all the places they had to go, the money they had spent, the drugs they have taken. And one particular lady was telling me that she couldn't even lift her arm beyond shoulder level. So she showed me by lifting her arms up. Wow. Another gentleman was telling me that she was in perpetual pain and now she, he can see the great difference and there was a big smile on his face. So when I am telling people about chiropractic, I don't talk about myself alone. I mention all those people who have also been here. So uh, Auntie Gloria, what will you tell what will you say to the people of the nation about their health and well-being and what action they should take? I believe that the fact that chiropractic uses the natural way of healing is the greatest news anybody can, can hear. And if you are not going to be on all these drugs which in the long run can give you other complications, then chiropractic is the first thing that people should use before they go taking all those drugs. Excellent. So, Auntie Gloria, last but not the least, uh, what, what do you think about Dr. Marcus's vision to improve and extend and save life for the people of Africa? I think it's a very good idea and I wish him all the best that he needs to let the rest of the country and the rest of the African continent know about chiropractic because I believe that that is the thing for the 21st century.